actually. Anyway, let's move on. The Times again. The King finally getting some rest, so he took a day off, Toby. Yeah, um, uh, yeah it, it's been described as a private day of reflection because yep. he's um, taking a day off before the funeral. Um, uh, but I think that's, you know, it's as though they have to kind of invent this kind of very dignified and respectable reason mm. for him to take a day off. I mean, he's been crisscrossing the United Kingdom. He's been to Edinburgh twice. He's been to Belfast. I mean, he's entitled to, you know, if, if they said he put his feet up and was watching The Great Escape and had ordered, you know, takeout, that would be fine. Why do they have to present it as a private day of reflection? I mean, I mean surely it's obvious to everyone that it's not just deserved, but absolutely necessary. You know, he had the, you know, he found out that his mother was seriously ill, then his mother dies, and then he's, he's the king, and he he has to go out and perform public he duties. I mean, he, he won't have had any time mm. to process. And the death of a mother is, of course, incredibly uh, serious in anyone's life. He's certainly earned it. I mean, he's travelled a huge amount of, of distance. He's, uh, he's had to, you know, like you say, do so many speeches, yeah. so, many, so much signing of documents. He's had to meet Nicola Sturgeon, which is never easy. <laughs> and um, and I, think he, I think he has impressed people as well. I mean, when we saw that guard fainting, I mean, guards are fainting. So yeah. imagine how it is if you're the, well, this, the king's age. There's also something about this stoicism of the royal family. You know, he was out there meeting people at the new monarch. And it, it, it's reminiscent to me of when Princess Diana died and her sons went out rather quickly to meet people and they had to put on this brave face and they were, what, 12? And, you know, really, it's something about that family that they cultivate this idea that actually we've got to get out there yeah. and get back to our duty. Or the, or, the, or the ones we like do. And I think that's, that's what's impressed people right. immediately about Charles, that he has taken on that duty. Yes. Whereas we see, obviously, others haven't. It is impressive. I can't think who you're alluding to there, <laughs> uh, Nick.